Hey there, Scorpios. Happy, happy birthday to each and every one of my November Scorpio birthday babies. Happy birthday to you, Scorpios. I hope you are having and going to have an absolutely amazing birthday, Scorpio. Scorpio, be the shit wherever you are, Scorpio, okay? You remember, Scorpio, we're celebrating Scorpioisms all the rest of 2021. And of course, blending right on in. I'm talking about we're going to strut into 2022 as if Scorpio uh, uh, is all about Scorpio still. Okay, Scorpio? Now, it's not coming from a place of pride or arrogance. It's just that this is a long deserved uh, recognition for Scorpio, even if it is self recognized. Okay, Scorpio? So. Happy, abundant, amazing birthday to each and every one of you, Scorpios. Make sure you celebrate your greatness, Scorpio, however it is, whatever it is, it is a part of you. Uh, celebrate yourself, Scorpio, in any and every way you deem necessary and possible, Scorpio, because you deserve it. Don't sell yourself short, not on your birthday. If someone wants to give you a gift, if someone wants to be nice, uh, you're that empress, remember, Scorpio. So quite naturally, uh, the townsmen always pay homage to uh, the empress. I'm just saying, Scorpio. So we're going to start this reading off, Scorpio. Now, remember, Scorpio, now, it's your birthday and everything, but still, this is still a general reading. It could be for anybody, any Scorpio. Remember, Scorpio, you can reverse the roles if you feel like it's not you. Uh, it, you know, look, now, we know the exes show up. We know the new love show up. Please don't take it out on brown eyes, okay? Because it is what it is. And no ex has control over you if you don't give that control up. So we're going to start off looking at your money, Scorpio. So Spirit, show me a couple of cards for Scorpio finances and money. What does Scorpio need to know and be aware of? Show me Scorpios. You got that gold card energy. It says solid finances, investing, integrity, deep values, now, this is what you have in general, solid fi finances, investing, uh, maybe you should invest, uh, you have integrity about your, you have something that is stored away here, deep values. Now, your career, it could be in banking, but some Scorpios are in a career for the long term here. You have a very upscale position and you do have a satisfying job. If you don't have this spirit is telling you it is here for you, uh, you can have that satisfying job that you can be in there long term and, and store up here where you're able to invest uh, in other places in your life, Scorpio. So goals, Scorpio. Spirit, show me more energy for Scorpio finances and career spirit. Scorpio finances and career. Ooh, we have Buddha. It says life purpose more than money. Spiritual wealth. Boy, they know we talking about Scorpio. It says spiritual wealth. Now in your career, some of you Scorpios could be a counselor, uh, a, a uh, being guided in a divine path. Your career could be that you're on a divine path. Now get this. And this is so befitting Scorpios. Spirit is telling you if you're choosing to um, follow your divine path, which is your life purpose, you're going to be wealthy. You're going to have more than money, Scorpio. You're going to have spiritual wealth. So in other words, your gifts make room for you. If you are on a spiritual journey and you choose to follow your spiritual path, Spirit wants you to know that it's only going to lead you to uh, spiritual wealth as well as uh, physical wealth. You're going to have more than money. You're going to get the money, but you're going to be empowered spiritually, Scorpio. So Scorpio, you have gold and you have Buddha. One more card for Scorpio spirit. What's up with Scorpio's money uh, and career? Show me Scorpio. It's rain in here, Scorpio. It looks like no. Ooh, I love this car. I see <laughs> eggs. It says starting over, saving up resources, nest egg. So spirit is trying to store your wealth up so that you would have financial freedom and financial security here. And in your career, Scorpio, some Scorpios are in the healthcare system, uh, but you have, uh, you could be in the insurance um what I feel like whatever you're dealing with now, 
it is going to help you build your savings. Your savings account is really going to grow. You're going to have money saved up for those rainy days, for those unexpected things that may arise. You're going to be able to bless other people because you're going to be in a position to do it. And you're very loving, nurturing and giving. So spirit knows exactly who to bless, to give. Spirit is going to give you the tools to be in that position, to be a blessing to other people. Uh, you're going to have new opportunities here in your career, Scorpio. So a lot of Scorpios are going to start a brand new career and it's going to be such a good financial financial uh, position that you will be able to set up you a nest egg, Scorpio. This is beautiful energy, Scorpio. Remember you have eggs, starting over, saving up resources, nest egg, healthcare, new opportunities and insurance. This is eggs and you have gold, solid finances, investing, integrity, deep values. And then you have in your career banking, long-term position, satisfying work. So you got something that's spiritually and emotionally satisfying Scorpio. Now, if you're in a position where it's not that way, either things are going to turn around for you in the position that you're in or spirit is going to elevate you to something new because you do have new opportunities here. And then this last beautiful, amazing energy is Buddha, which is your life purpose more than money. It is spiritual wealth and for your career. And you know that a part of your spiritual divine path is being a counselor and being spiritually guided here. So your counselor being guided and divine path, your divine path being a counselor is going to bring you not only money, but more than money. It's going to bring you spiritual wealth, Scorpio. So let's see, let's, what, where are we going to go next here? So let's see what else, what else, what else? So let's pull, let's see what your person is thinking. Now, for you Scorpios who are on a twin flame uh, journey, you know, there's a lot of soulmate energies that's been coming up here lately, Scorpio. Let's see what messages from your person, Scorpio. Now, <laughs> nine times out of 10, this is a, a, a X energy, but some Scorpios, it could be your, your future uh, twin flame that's coming towards you here. And, and, and the hold up, the reason why you haven't uh, you know, met this person or, you know, started this relationship is because of something that's going on in their life, uh, that they need to resolve. So I'm going to, I'm going to see what these three cards fill out. It says, I'm hiding my true feelings from you. So for some of you Scorpios, your person, you may not have heard from this person. Uh, they ain't saying shit. They trying to act all reserved. They trying to act like they just living their best life. But there's no possible way if Scorpio is not in it. I'm just saying. But they're hiding their true feelings from you. Especially if you had a, a person from your past that's coming around acting nonchalant. Uh, that you make them nervous, I feel like. Because they're hiding their feelings for, from you, Scorpio. And it says, the next card says, when we're together, I feel alive. And time stands still. Boy, you sure is talking about Scorpio. Scorpio has that effect on you. You won't want to be that way. See, let me tell you something about Scorpio. Scorpio be making the, the players fall for Scorpio. I'm talking about the, the hardest of them hard end, end up falling for Scorpio. But they be so disappointed in themselves that they done fail for your ass, Scorpio, that they try to hide their true feelings because the player ends up getting play Scorpio with their emotions, but they feel like there's a strong magnetic attraction and a, a chemistry that is so spiritual because you make them feel alive. See, this is part of your divine path, Scorpio. You are a energetically spiritual counselor. Uh, you're being guided. I feel like you were guided to your person, Scorpio, to help your person in some type of way because they feel alive when they're with you. They, they say time freaking stands still, Scorpio. In other words, they never want it to end. They can just hear you and be around you forever because of something about your energy, Scorpio, that is absolutely contagious, Scorpio. And this other card says financial issues are a concern. So for some of you, Scorpios, whoever uh, this person is, uh, they're hiding their true feelings from you because they do have financial issues are a concern. I feel like if they're around you, they're going to be consumed with you and they got too many, too much other shit going on, Scorpio. Show me some more energy for this person who is thinking about Scorpio spirit. Show me. 
I can hear you, Scorpio, even in the silence. You a bad mother, dad ass, shut your mouth. You hear that shit? They hear you. They said, I can hear you even in the silence. They said, I know the radio turned down. The TV ain't even on. Ain't nobody outside. But I can still hear you. Ooh, it's like you really made an impression on this person, Scorpio. And you wouldn't even know it because they're hiding their true feelings from you. Ain't that some shit? Ooh, that's the typical thing. Show me some more energy for this person, Spirit. How does this person feel about Scorpio? I regret the way I left things, Scorpio. They regret how they left things, Scorpio. They regret how they left things with you, Scorpio. They regret it. They do. Scorpio like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Burn his drawers and type of shit, <laughs> Scorpio. I'm telling you something. Scorpio is a loving Scorpio when Scorpio feel like you're invested in Scorpio. But if Scorpio ever get the inclination that you are playing Scorpio, it just it just changes the energy with Scorpio. I'm telling you, it, it, it changes the energy with Scorpio. Um, financial issues are a concern. I'm going to try to pull a clarifier for this with this gypsy card here. Because these gypsy cards is very intense. So let's see. Spirit, show us, uh, clarify this financial issues are a concern for Scorpio's person. What is this about? Let's see, Scorpio. Love. Love, Scorpio. It say love. Look. Financial issues are a concern. So this person, either this person is in love with you and they don't want to come to you because of their financial issues, Scorpio. What is this about, Spirit? Clarify. Give me another card for this financial issues are a concern in love. What does this love represent for Scorpio's person pertaining to Scorpio? Clarify this financial issues are concern in love. Pleasure seekers. Pleasure seekers. So this person is a pleasure seeker, Scorpio. That's like the three of cups here. So maybe this person is tied up with someone. I have to get another card. Give me another card, spirit. Pleasure seekers and love. This person could be strung out on, you got messenger here. So I feel like this person does not want to reach out to you or kind of wants to reach out. I feel like this person is tied up in a love triangle, Scorpio, that's affecting their money. Because you got love, pleasure seekers, and messenger. I feel like this person is stuck in a love triangle that's affecting their money some kind of way. Oh, Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. I regret how I left things. And I ain't going to pull too many of these because everybody not on Twin Flame with everybody really is on a spiritual connection. Because when you join with anybody, it is some type of spiritual connection, whether it's toxic or healthy. What, what is this? I regret the way I, we left things for Scorpio's person spirit. What is this about? Letter. So either you guys did, either you guys did a bunch of negative talking towards each other, or this person regret not communicating with you, Scorpio. I feel like for some of you, Scorpio, this person just ghosted you and didn't say shit. Now they're regretting not explaining and talking to you, Scorpio. I feel like this person wants to talk to you so bad. Every time they start off trying to reach out to you, they they hold themselves back because they got other shit going on. Clarify this regret the way, uh, clarify this, I regret the way we left things for Scorpio in this letter. What is this about for Scorpio? Soldier. Who? so now this soldier could represent that this person was, give me another card for this card spirit. What is this about? Maybe this person felt waiting, waiting. This person left you waiting, Scorpio, but this soldier energy, I don't know what the soldier's about. Either it could be this person kept their guards up to you and had you waiting. I feel like this person 
regret the way they left things was that they they left no communication. But most of you Scorpios, you got ghosted by your person, and it's because they're put they put their guards up towards you and left you waiting, Scorpio, and they regret that shit now. They regret all of this because they most of you people, most of you Scorpios, your person call themselves putting a guard up against you, Scorpio, by ghosting you and not talking to you. And in return, it left you waiting and they knew this shit. This is why they regret it now, Scorpio. Ooh, Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Ooh, I'm hiding my true feelings from you. This will be the last one I do over here. Ooh, I'm hiding my true feelings from you. What is this about? despair oh this person is having a meltdown scorpio because i feel like all they're doing is thinking about because the regret we know that that's the five of cups energy despair is like the five of cups energy too because this person is hiding their true feelings from you in in there is this person is kind of like they're a hopeless romantics i'm not gonna say a romantic but this person is hopelessly in love with you but they can't do anything about it oh scorpio scorpio Ooh, foe. You remember the saying, go friend or foe? This is a foe. So this person may be hiding their true feelings because they got a foe in the mix. This person is hiding their true feelings from you, Scorpio, because this person is full of despair because of the company they got around them. They ain't got friends. They got enemies. Well, you remember, it's either friend or foe. This is a foe. <laughs> This is a foe, Scorpio. This is an enemy, so to speak, Scorpio. So this person is hiding their true feelings with you because it's almost like this person is around a very narcissistical, uh, karmic type of energy, Scorpio. Who spirit? Give me one more card from hiding my true feelings for you. Ooh, Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Look, did I just tell you? Look, enemy any me i'm telling you this person must be hooked up with some wrong type of energy scorpio this is why they hide themselves from you seem like this person and got like i said this person's in some type of love triangle scorpio with this uh pleasure seekers and love this person is in a love triangle this person obviously i feel like it's when this message is concerned i feel like this message is dealing with um some type of sexual, uh, you know, some sexual invitation here. This person's caught up in some type of love triangle and it's affecting them financially here. Ooh, Scorpio, this is why this person had their true feelings for you because they with the enemy. They got negative karmic people around them. All right, when we're together, I feel alive. Let me, let me see what this is about real quick. Clarify this card. Clarify when we're together, I feel alive and time stands still. Ooh, melancholy, melancholy. Ain't that some shit? When we're together, I feel alive and time stands still. If that ain't melancholy, I don't know what it is. This look, look how she thinking. This your person. This how they, when they think about you, this person is like they're in a trance. Time stands still, and they 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 uh embrace the energy that you bring them. Now they're surrounded by fake ass enemies and shit, losing money. They ain't got shit going on. But they love this is that melancholy where when they think about you, they get so happy. Woo, this is what happens when they're with you, Scorpio. They get that melancholy energy. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh, Spirit, give me one more card, please, for this. When we're together, I feel alive and time stands still. Clarify this card for Scorpio's person. Wife. <laughs> This all this person think about and what this is what they think about is if they if you was their wife Scorpio this is what this person thinks about if Scorpio was my wife I wish I would have settled down with Scorpio they thinking about what it would be like if you were their wife they feel like their whole life would be different because now this person just roam in the streets like a, a loose dog Scorpio. And they're suffering because of it. So they low-key love you, but they can't even express that. They just sitting in regret and misery. <laughs> Give me one more card for when we're together, I feel alive. Ooh, Scorpio. 
misfortune. This person is thinking about what, what a misfortune it was that they're not around you because everything around their life since you guys are not together is falling apart here. It's like when they think about you and building a life with you, it's time stands still. But when they're back in reality, it's a misfortune. It's really a misfortune how they treated you, Scorpio, because now they're dealing with the life that they chose, Scorpio. Underneath the bottom, you have young woman. See, the, uh, this is the same energy pleasure seekers. They're seeking love from, from younger people. Uh, you know, and this younger person is getting them for their money, but you wasn't about that. You was wife and material. You wanted to build with this person, Scorpio. I ain't going to, oh, what is this? I can hear you in my silence. Give me one card for I can hear you even in my silence. It says child. <laughs> I can hear you even in my silence. And it says, child, what is this about? See there? I can hear you even in my challenge. Maybe they think about even in that. Wait a minute. Give me one more card, please, Spirit. What is this about? Prison. You got child and you have prison. For some of you, Scorpio, this person is in jail. Or maybe going to jail. Or this person is mentally, this person, now this person, it says child, maybe this person is stuck up on the past. Ooh, Scorpio, this thing got weird. I don't want to spend too much time. Give me one more card. This person is mentally in their head. Consolation here. It's something, I feel like this person has a baby, Scorpio. It's like, look, in, whenever this person has some alone time here, and I feel like it's not a lot of time, but I even feel like they can be in a room full of uh, loud, crowded people, but in their head, it's all about you. I feel like this person is physically and mentally bound, and uh, they need some help. <laughs> they need some constant. This person need, is praying. This person is praying to be out of whatever they're in. I feel like this person is in a mental prison, Scorpio. And for some of your, your person, they're physically in prison here. And it could be over a child. Ooh, all right, let me let me get get away from these cards. Damn. But you see this person thinking about you. They regret everything. They feel melancholy energy, Scorpio. When they, when, when they, it says, I, when we're to, look, when we're together, I feel alive. They feel like you're their wife, Scorpio. And time stands still because we had wife there. This person feel like you're already theirs in a committed relationship when you guys are together. I feel like when you guys are not together, this person fights their lust and their, their unhealthy lifestyle, Scorpio. Ooh, Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Now, let's keep on pulling now. All right, Spirit, show me love and romance for Scorpio. Who is coming towards Scorpio? What does Scorpio need to know for Scorpio's birthday? Y'all gonna be so happy, Scorpio. Get happy, Scorpio. Sell it. You don't have to wait till you see it. You don't have to wait till it's in your hand. Celebrate yourself and your happiness right now, Scorpio. Okay? That's what it's about. All right, let's see what you got going. You got that king of swords looking ugly. That's why his ass upside down. <laughs> Spirit, show me what's going on with Scorpio. All right, Scorpio. So the first card out is strength here. So someone may be trying to hold themselves back from you, Scorpio. If this is not someone trying to hold themselves back from you, Scorpio, then it is you in your power. Spirit, clarify strength for Scorpio. up the tower car scorpio so i feel like someone is trying to hold themselves back scorpio or i feel like someone couldn't hold the, someone couldn't uh someone who couldn't keep their penis in their pants and is then came back and bit them in the ass scorpio all because they couldn't uh they couldn't curb their manhood or their womanhood but there you go though scorpio 
See, you look at you always good. See, you're not a part of the bullshit. You say you will stay single and abundant. You're confident. You will get it on your own till spirit sends you the right one in this nine of pentacles, Scorpio. They look, no wonder. Look, <laughs> I feel like someone is wanting you so bad, Scorpio, but I feel like that same energy of not being able to resist uh, beautiful women or beautiful men is the very same thing that has came back against this person. It could be a Leo here. Could be an Aries here. You sure be getting Leo. You getting a lot of fire energy lately, Scorpio. Spirit, clarify this nine of pentacles for Scorpio. See? Now, some of you Scorpios are doing very good independently. You're making money. You're secure. But when it comes to your love, you're a very choosy lover. And some Scorpios, the only thing, beautiful thing you got going on in your life, and that's good, is that you're doing good financially. You're independent, but in your love life, you're bored and, and not happy. You're like, yeah, I'm, I'm good. I'm independent. I'm this and I'm that. But I still got to go home and get in that big ass king size, California king size water bed alone. Now, Scorpio, you know you got a water bed. You water. See, I feel like you're bored. You, you're happy. You're content, but you want more. You need, you need, <laughs> Scorpio need a boo when they like. <laughs> Now, I feel like e either this is you need getting, either this is you, you're, you're confident, you're on your game, but when it comes to love, that's the only thing that's missing in your life. And then for some Scorpios, you're not accepting offers even when they do come because you to put you, you, you too high up for them now, Scorpio. You to, you to put yourself in a position where you're untouchable, Scorpio. And, and it's good if, if you got the wrong people coming towards you, but you don't want to miss out on something beautiful coming towards you. Spirit, show me what's coming towards Scorpio. You got the three of swords here. So I hope this ain't you, Scorpio. I hope you don't have a heartbreak coming. Maybe someone who is heartbroken coming towards you. Oh, look. <laughs> That's who it is. <laughs> That's that person who can't show their true feelings, Scorpio. They heartbroken. Because I feel like this person's having tower moments in their life because of they got too many. If we go by this twin flame, this spiritual connection here, then somebody uh, is, 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 is hold out, okay? They don't hold out. <laughs> Look, but there go your long-term commitment right there. See, Scorpio's. Who's for some Scorpios, you are doing exactly right. You are holding out. You are rejecting offers that are beneath you and you're holding out for a long-term commitment. You don't just want nobody rushing into you cause they horny. You know what I'm saying? Cause all the thing is going to do is just tear down everything you've built and it will leave you heartbroken. But I feel like for you Scorpios, it, you know, that could be one scenario, but another scenario is that you know your power. You're doing your own shit alone. And ain't nobody building with you. So quite naturally, you're very selective.